Hi guys, I'm Khaled Abdelaziz and today I'm going to be going through my community project, you know, in a brief way explaining some parts but not some others, just to give you a feel of what, what my community project was like. Introduction My name is Khaled Abdelaziz, as I mentioned. I'm a student in the Modern Maturity School, also known as the MMS. I'm originally from Palestine, born in the USA, and I live in the beautiful country of Jordan as of now. I strongly believe that gender inequality is a thing in Jordan, which is my target community in this project, and that it should be changed in order for us as individuals and as a community to develop. So I decided to take action in my community project, which has the goal of helping to achieve, you know, gender equality, which will be addressed by raising awareness about gender inequality. Investigation. When I first started my community project, I really wanted to do something that is certainly based on my personal interest. Gender inequality was a problem in my community, Jordan, for ages, and I know that existed by the use of social media and the news. Women were always treated inappropriately and abused. Men were always offered different opportunities, but not women, due to differences based solely on issues of gender. So I decided to discuss this problem in my community that my community faces, as well as the rest of the world due to the fact that I really respect and value women in our community. In my project, I use multiple research kits to successfully raise awareness and help my community, such, like searching for information, attention to detail, taking notes about important information, time management, problem solving, communicating my results clearly. Preparation. Going into my project, I didn't have much to prepare for. I just had to manage my time and work on a community project and submit all the parts on entries on time in the right manner. Since I already knew what a community project slash service is, since I already took a services action in the first semester of my ongoing school year. Talking about my time management skills, I used a lot of self-management skills and improved not only there to complete my project on time in the right manner. Self-measurement skills I used include organization, effective and reflective skills. You could see in the bullet points the example of each. I'm not gonna go in too detailed into them. Action. Following our original plan, I created an Instagram page, posted online posts that was created due to my prior knowledge and some research, then raised awareness about you know gender inequality by the use of the gender inequality page which I created and the posters. I use also text messages and on Instagram and voice chats on team to communicate and consult different people in my in the completion of my project, being the people I interviewed, like my peers and my followers to see what do they think about my work and if it affected them in any way. To demonstrate the you know, communication social and I created a table to analyze and evaluate ideas of the internet page. I wanted to create the website at first, but then I did the table to evaluate, you know, the ideas and I chose the Instagram page, which was the most feasible one as a final product. Reflection, here's my reflection. You could pause the video and read it, but I'm just gonna say, long story short, this community project was astounding and wonderful, and I'm happy with my result. I could have done better, but you know, anyway, I can't wait to do more of these and, and hopefully do better in the next time. You know, all in all, the demonstration of my results you can check out my results, you know, or not my results, but like more of my action, you know, on my Instagram page, which has a username of gender underscore inequality underscore arise, you can see, which you can see on the page right here. Basically, I created an Instagram page during my community project, posted information about the page, you know, or about the cause on the page, and I asked one of my followers some questions to see the effect of the page on the people, and then reflected on the process which has you know which you can see here from the start till the end and yeah i really appreciate community service learning and would love to repeat this as i mentioned this was an amazing experience and i'd love to do this in the future all in all thank you for watching and i'll catch you later